chicken with broccoli. So we're going to cut up our broccoli florets and get it prepared. And then we're going to blanch it for about five minutes in some hot water. After we will remove and set aside. So there we have our blanched broccoli florets. Now we're going to cut up some onion, garlic, three garlic cloves and some scythe. Or you can use green onions. So there we chop up the, the onion and the garlic that we're going to use to saute for our minced chicken with broccoli. We're cutting up our scythe which we will add at the end of cooking. So there we have those ingredients. Now we have our minced chicken. So let's get our minced chicken uh, seasoned and prepared. This is one and a half tablespoons of cornstarch. This is one tablespoon of your favorite seasoning blend and half a teaspoon of salt. Alright, so we're going to add our seasoned blend and salt and our cornstarch to our minced chicken and we're going to mix well. We're going to add one tablespoon of rice cooking wine, mix that well and set aside. Now we're going to make our sauce. So we need one cup, one cup of chicken broth, two tablespoons of soy sauce, Two tablespoons of um, oyster sauce. We also need one tablespoon of rice cooking wine, which was the first thing that I had put in. Just getting some problems getting the oyster sauce to come out. So there you have it. And then about a quarter teaspoon of sesame oil, and we mix that together well. All right, let's make a little slurry. That's a cornstarch with some water to thicken up our sauce. All right, time to cook. So we're gonna add some coconut oil to our wok. We're gonna add in our onion and garlic. Saute for a while. And then we're gonna add in our minced chicken and we're gonna cook that thoroughly. sure it's cooked completely after it has cooked completely we will remove it add a little more oil to the wok and we will add now our broccoli and we're gonna just I, I add a little bit of the sauce to help to scrape off the bottom of the pan uh, of the wok um, to, you know get all that brown bits off and then I added back the chicken and then we add the rest of the sauce and we just let that cook for a bit and then we will add our slurry to thicken up the sauce and basically that's it we sprinkle it with our side and it's ready to eat enjoy mm -hmm.